No, nah, this one we gotta we gotta talk That's about. That's accurate. This one. That's accurate. We gotta talk about this one. What do you want to talk about? Why? Like why lie? You do that? <laughs> yeah. Yo, what is good YouTube and welcome back to another video on this channel with your boy Nihilus and it's today. I have, this, I have a special guest. I brought my friend Giselle back onto the channel. <laughs> <laughs> and as you guys saw by the title, man, today we're going to be talking about or having her react to things that guys do but won't actually admit to girls, right? So she kind of gave me this idea. So she came up with a list off of the internet. I'm assuming Google or something yeah. like that, right? So basically, she's going to be going through some things of her own and that she found from the internet that like 99% of guys do but won't actually tell females so I'm basically gonna be here telling you guys if it's true or not and what Don't lie. I personally you can't do, lie. I'm gonna be dead honest okay. in this video right. I'm gonna be completely honest in this video but before we even get into this video man I want you guys to leave a like down below and subscribe to the channel if you are new and also all my social media will be linked down below without further ado let's 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 spill the tea man let's see what's really going on Okay. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. So for the first one that I um, came up with, this is something that I feel like guys always do, but they just won't admit it. Like, I don't know why. I think it's a very normal thing to do. Why? But like crying or like being emotional, like they just don't. That's true, but that's a mix, that's a mixy one, honestly. How? Because I, I feel like I'm the type of guy, I'm the type of guy who I wear my emotions on my sleeve most of the time. Like if I feel like I have to cry, then I'm going to cry. You feel me? Mm -hmm. Like a lot of guys find it like, oh, he cries as a bitch, blah, blah, blah. But I don't think about it like that. If I cry, then I cry. So I just don't see the point. Like, so if you wouldn't, you wouldn't feel like if a guy started crying in front of you. Let's say you're arguing with a guy, whatever the case is, and he starts crying before you start crying. How would you feel? I would feel like I'd feel like like sympathy. I'd be, I'd feel <laughs> yeah, bad. <laughs> yes, I would. You would be like, look at this no, bitch ass. What? No, I would never. No, would. no, no. I would never. I would feel like sympathy. I would start getting emotional because <laughs> you don't see that. It's so rare from a guy to like, like. Oh my god, this nigga's mad soft. No. <laughs> That's not the truth. I I know I wouldn't. Maybe some females would, but like, no way. That's why guys don't cry because they don't want to be looked at like that. Yeah, I think it's like a like a masculinity thing. Like I don't a societal fuck, thing. I don't care. Damn, should I let should I let this grow out? Yeah, you know these type beasts. Like, like a Clarence one. Oh my god, get this nigga, get this nigga out of my channel. What Shoot me! <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Things guys do but won't admit. Sitting down to pee. <laughs> I have never done that. The never. Only, I've never done that. All right, look. Sitting down, I've never sat down to pee. <laughs> but I feel like guys, like I know, like. But, okay, let me let me give you an example of when it did happen. So you have done it. Yeah, but not intentionally. But you can't be saying, "Oh, I've never done it." But not intentionally though. It's been on some like, like you know, like I'll be in the bathroom about to take a a number two. I sit down and I pee first, mm. and then I take my number two. But there have been times where. I sit down to shit, and then I pee, and then I don't really have to like shit. So it's just like I sat down to pee, but that wasn't the intention. But what's wrong with sitting down and peeing? What? A, what? I don't think I don't think a guy who's like you feel me about himself would sit down to pee. I would never do that, and I have never done that intentionally. Is it, but is there like a reason? Because you stand up, you hold your shit. But you can sit down. And tuck your shit in between your legs. <laughs> you can sit down, you can sit down and tuck your shit. <laughs> that's what you want me to do? I'm not doing I that. know that's how it all works. Okay, <laughs> whatever then. Next one. Watching porn to learn new moves. You do that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but this is, when I was, this is when I was younger though. Nah. No, I don't do that now. It's new ways. It's new I mean, yo, techniques. Yo, people are creative, bro. Yo, people are very creative. They're always coming up with something new. But I don't I don't watch it for that reason. I barely even watch it. Now you barely even watch it. That, 
I barely watch it. It's like weird <clears throat> to watch it for new moves. When I was young, when I was like 14, 15, 16, I was a virgin. I'll be like, damn. I was a virgin. I was a virgin. I'll be like, damn, like, how do I get to this position? Like, what, like, what do I do to put her in this position? Mm. How do I get there? It's so porn. What's the answer? That was the answer. Because it gave me the answers. You feel me? It gave me all of the answers. This, I know guys guys do this all the time, and I find it so gross. And they think they're like low key about it too. What? But like touching their freaking private part, like over oh, yeah, here. Yeah, I, I do that all the time. I do that. No. All of the time. Not even low key, or like you guys think you're low key, and I'm just like. Nah, I'll be. I'll touch. I'll touch my. B whatever, I'm not gonna lie. That's like if, I, if I'm on a date, or if I'm on like in the train, or if, like if I'm at a restaurant. Or somewhere public where it shouldn't be done, I'm probably not gonna do it. But if I need to readjust, you I'm doing that shit. Doing it? Hell yeah! And it's not even something <laughs> I'm gonna hide. I don't care if you see me. <laughs> you know I, mean? nah, I don't I even care. I saw another one. It was like it like it, like it elaborated on it, and it was like what guys do, but won't admit is they'll do that, but then they'll smell it's their hair. Hair. <laughs> I've done that disgusting. before. That's so nasty. Dude. I can admit to that. I right, but look. Girls be doing that too, though. What? Y'all don't be on some. Y'all don't be smelling yourselves. I like that. We don't gotta do all that. Like, you don't smell yourself. Of course I do. But like, if I'm in public, I'm not reaching down my damn pants and <laughs> smelling. Nah, nah, not in public. No. Not in public. I don't. I don't do that in public, and I hope none of my friends do that in public. That's dirty. So you just be chilling at home, and you'll just be like. Yeah, I'll be like, if I'm like, I'll be like this, no cap, and I'll like adjust my boxers or something. That's like, I don't know, that's, that's like, me though. I guess so. I don't really care. It's me. It's a guy thing for sure. And I be clean, so I don't even mad at me. I don't even mad. At if you know you be clean, then why you smell it? Gotta make sure though. <laughs> gotta make sure. <laughs> Master. I'll be beating myself. <laughs> it's coronavirus, man. It's quarant it's you got quarantine. people lonely. Got people acting different. <laughs> Cochino, oh my I, I'll God. tell you too. I feel like, what is there really to hide, bro? Everybody does. But it. like that, are some guys will like really hide that. Like they won't admit it. They're like, nah, I never, never match. I'm to do that. Really? Like, yeah. Nah. Things guys do but won't admit. Finding another girl attractive while in a relationship. Would I admit that? I probably, I would probably admit that. In the slight way, but guys do, of course, everybody guys do find other girls attractive. That's regardless, and girls find other guys attractive while they're in a relationship too. But will we admit that though? Yeah, I would. You would? I would. But I would admit it in a subtle way. How subtle? Cause I'm not taking that subtle. Like if a guy I'm in a relationship with, like it'll be different if it's like, like it would really have to be a bad, like bad. You're telling me a bitch is attractive. Like she gotta be. I gotta think she's bad if you tell yeah. me to my face. Now if it's someone that's like, <laughs> why like you so hurt? Because I'm just trying to picture that. Like I would be tight if it's not something like if she's not like. Oh no! I would be honest, be like, I'm like, man, she was alright. I'm not gonna sit here and be like, oh nah, she's ugly. Oh no! Now nah, I'm lying. I'm just gonna be like, yeah, she was. But you don't even gotta say nothing. It just not say nothing. Nah, but that's like an elephant in the room. <laughs> Things guys do, I'll admit. How many bodies they have? <laughs> no, this one gets me tight. <laughs> Why lie? No, nah, this one we gotta we gotta talk. That's about accurate. This one. That's accurate. We gotta talk about this one. What do you want to talk about? Why? Like why lie? Why lie about what? About how many bodies you have? No, I feel like a lie thing. If a girl asks me how many bodies I have, I wouldn't be on some. Well, I only have two bodies. I wouldn't say that. That's a lie. I would never lie, but. I'm not gonna tell you a number. Mm -hmm. is, is there a reason? As a girl, do you feel comfortable talking about your body count? Yeah. No? Yeah. I don't see it as a like problem. That's, like, that's, like, if we're in a relationship. If that's different, I feel like it doesn't matter at that point. If you're in a relationship, I feel like, why do you care? You shouldn't care. If we're in a relationship and, I'm, and I like the show, do whatever the case is, and like, like we're trying to you know, grow and we're talking for a minute, I'll tell you how many bodies I have and I'll tell you. Who they were if you care to know i'll be transparent about that but if we're just talking and you're on some like how many bodies do you have why would i tell you 
Like, who are you? <laughs> Ew. Okay. Wearing the same boxers or socks to <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. That's, that, that's nasty. <laughs> Some niggas be doing it. Yo. Just freaking put on a new pair. Or go nah. take a shower. Nah, some niggas be doing it. I've done it before. It's like one of those things like, you feel me? You just hopped at the shower. You clean, but you gotta do laundry. So you just either go commando for the day or you just throw on the boxers to step outside real quick. So you take a full on shower. Yeah, you take a shower. Come out. See the un the boxes you was wearing yesterday and put that back on. Alright, now it don't have it doesn't happen like that, right? No, but we trying to get too specific. Long story short, that's what you be doing. Nah, <laughs> nah, that's not what I be doing. Alright, let me tell you, let me tell you a scenario in which it did happen. For example, I went camping every year. My family and I goes camping. We go on a little camping trip, right? And there was one time I didn't bring enough boxers for the camping trip, or no, I did bring enough, but I would take showers. Two times out, of, two times out of the day, and then wear the boxers. So I ran short from boxers. Mm. So on the last day, I just put on the same boxers. So like I was clean, I took a shower and everything. I just threw the same boxers on to leave that day. And that's just in that situation, I feel like it's acceptable because I'm not gonna go commando. What if they dirty? I don't get dirty. <laughs> I don't get dirty. Okay. Immaculate, come on now. You be like flipping them inside out? Oh no! That's a dirty name. <laughs> if he flips it inside out, that means he does that shit often. That's a dirty name if he does that. <laughs> That's not me. I can never be me. Oh the These guys do. Okay. Picking their nose. I will never tell you if I pick my nose. Why? That's weird. That's like, not even on some nasty shit, but that's on some like little kid shit. <laughs> Like you picking your nose like <laughs> That's weird. But do you? I do. <laughs> I do. It's dirty, dude. I do. Wow. Well, I use a napkin though. No, you don't. No, I do. If I'm in my car, I'm got some. No, I use a napkin like that. Like. I've seen, yo. I will, I would be driving. And seeing things in a brain. Picking they for be gold. up here, Looking bro. Looking for gold, dude. Like this <laughs> image. That's it's nasty. nasty. You like niggas like that? No. Yes, you do something like Look at you. <laughs> I really be looking at them too. I'm like, and I hope they look at me. Like this. No. Shit. It's Crazy. So, nasty. so that's going to be the end of this video, guys. Um, You guys got the answers. You feel me? I, I gave you guys a little insight from the guy perspective, being honest and truthful. Never needed to lie. Keep it a book with y'all. But. If you made it up to the end of the video, I want you guys to hit the comment section and just type in the T. If you made it up to this part of the video, I want you guys to comment right now the T. But on that note, leave a like. Stay tuned to Nitro TV for more like content. I'm going to catch y'all later, bro. Peace.